What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome back to another FIFA 22 video EA have released. I'm Medic, no you're Eric, Laporte, Showdown and Curtis Jones, Showdown. Curtis Jones, of course, one of the most popular cards on FIFA 21. He is back for FIFA 22, Man City versus Liverpool, one of the biggest games in the calendar year, in the league, on the game, the big game of football because... Pretty much the winner will win the league, I'd say. What do you say? Who do you think is going to win? Man City or Liverpool? I think 2-1 City, even though Liverpool have probably got the best attack, like combined attack, I suppose, in world football right now. Maybe not the best individual players, but as a whole, as a collective, you know, maybe that Real Madrid attack is better. Maybe the Arsenal attack is better, but I mean, hey, they got some madness. But it's an 89, I medic Laporte. He's got great sprint speed, good acceleration, nice passing, really nice dribbling outside of agility and balance, really nice defending, and good physical. And he's got the chance of getting a plus two. Curtis Jones, four-star, four-star. The flair trait, high medium work rate, six foot one, good pace, okay shooting, really nice passing, good vision, good short pass, decent long pass really good dribbling that composure dribbling and ball control is fantastic that agility is good the balance and reactions could do with a bit of work great stamina good physicals otherwise and decent defensive stats i immediately think an engine chem style is what i'd be putting on jones now the interesting thing is curtis jones is one segment the fact that this is an 89 rated card that could get upgraded i have to believe that i made a report is going to be an 84 and an 85 and Curtis Jones is going to be an 89. That's what I think. I think it's going to be an 89 rated squad needed. An 87 with a team of the week and a Liverpool player in 55 chem. That's not awful. And I medic Laporte, an 83 with an informative Man City player. And an 87, what? What? You can't be real. You can't be charging more for a defender. And a midfielder. What this tells me is that EA think that Laporte is going to get upgraded. EA think that he's going to go to the 91. And that is why they have made him more expensive than Curtis Jones. Because that is bonkers. That is bonkers. All right. We've got outside of that. Absolutely sod all. Any new icons today? No. Any new leagues today? I asked, but I know the answer. I, I know the answer. Any new objectives today? Silver Star Showdown. That was there from yesterday. Silver Beast, not new. Milestones, not new. Season, progress and events, not new. So before we go into footbin and have a look at what may or may not be there, Let's see if there's a new splash screen. Anything changing on the loading screen? Of course, Foot Captains is coming tomorrow. Ooh. Okay. What this tells us straight away is that the card on the left is indeed the, um, the hero moments, I believe they're going to be called. And so we're going to be getting the Foot Captains and there's going to be a German with 91 shooting. And that is, I'm pretty sure, going to be Marco Royce because guesswork definitely haven't seen a leak and then the captain on the left is going to be the hero premier league 95 pace could be any of the ones that we've already had could be Solskjaer although 95 pace maybe not could be Keane potentially could be Lundberg potentially could be a could be David Ginola right it could be a different Nate league for the player um we will take a little look at Twitter and see what's popping off over there just in case there's something we should see and uh who that might be but first and foremost by the way if you missed out uh, earlier on today i uploaded the video just discussing the upgrades on the um foot fantasy cards i have a feeling laporte's going to be downvoted and oh marky matchups today as well i forgot about that yeah jones upvoted laporte downvoted yeah and and it, it's just it's, it's a joke right i don't understand why um 
why that's like that, really. All right, here we go. Curtis Jones, he's been given 18 pace, 17 shooting, 17 passing, 17 dribbling, 15 defending and physical. The previous card that he had, this one here, I think went down so well. He's got one more pace than that, three less shooting, two less passing, nine, nine more dribbling, one less physical, three less defending. Or the left mid version, of course, which had nice pace, nice dribbling. I think... Yeah, this one's probably better than that left mid version. Overall, this is a good card, man. As I say, I think straight away I'd go with Engine. Makes his dribbling very good. Very good pace. Great passing. Good shooting from range. Good defending. Good physicals. Four star, four star. Real nice. You could go with the Maestro. The 95 centre mid. Great passing. Great shooting from range. And great dribbling with good pace. You could go for the Marksman. Really well-rounded dribbling, much better shooting, nice physicals. It's not bad. It's not bad. I do quite like it. And then we've got Imedic Laporte as well. So he's been given based off of his uh, his card, his gold card, 21 pace. And then otherwise a relatively mediocre upgrade. Seven dribbling, four defending, six physical. Now, don't get me wrong. This is a good card, right? And with a Shadow Chem style, you know... <laughs> with a Shadow Chem style, 98 sprint speed, 89 acceleration, near perfect defending, good passing, very good dribbling, good physicals. With an Anchor Chem style, it becomes a 96 rated centre back. Again, near perfect defending, near perfect physicals with good pace. Both of them have the capabilities of getting upgraded by uh, by that plus two or even plus one on the pair of them. But I'm just not so sure that I think the pricing is very good. Let's have a look at marquee matchups. What we've got for today. We've got LA Galaxy against Los Angeles. Um, we've got Fenerbahce against Galatasaray. Hertha Berlin against Union Berlin. And Man City versus Liverpool. Man City versus Liverpool needs an 81 rated squad. And offers a premium gold players pack. Mega pack for the whole set. Small rare gold players pack. Quite nice. Jumbo premium gold pack. Nice and premium election players pack. It's nice. You know, you're going to pay about 30k to complete the whole of marquee matchups. And get yourself about 100k's worth of packs. It's not bad at all. What I think is not right, I suppose, is yeah, Laporte's coming in at about 30k more expensive than Curtis Jones. I do think in general, with the fact that we know Team of the Season is coming uh, April 29th, with the fact that we're getting a brand new promo tomorrow for the Foot Captains and the new Heroes, I do certainly think that in any case, this is a lot of coins. You know, I, I you know, yesterday we looked at these, they are terribly priced, but, you know... If you want both of these, it's near half a million coins for these two players. Now, if you're a Liverpool fan or a City fan, you're going to do the one that suits your club. You know, if there was an Arsenal showdown, I would have done it in a heartbeat. No question about it. But it's expensive. It's surprising that Jones is cheaper than Laporte. I personally would say, here, yeah, go and do Jones. He looks pretty decent. Laporte, I think there's so many defenders that are out there that are as good, if not better. But that is going to be the end of the video today. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like rating, comment, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And for now, guys, I'm out. Peace.